Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be demonstrating the utilization of Adobe Firefly, a cutting-edge AI image generation tool developed by Adobe. Currently in its beta stage, access to this tool requires an invitation. In this video, I will guide you through the process of requesting access, comprehending basic prompts, exploring various image types, styles, and additional functionalities. Furthermore, we will generate anime art and explore the text effect generator. Let's begin. Oh, wait a minute, I have spent hours crafting this free tutorial just for you. Would you please give me 5 seconds of your precious time for a quick like and comment. Thank you so much, my dear friend. Access request to utilize Adobe Firefly. It is necessary to request access. Visit firefly.adobe.com. Locate the Request Access button and provide your details. Ensure that your Adobe ID has the same email address as the one used during registration. In my experience, it took approximately one business day to receive the invitation. Once you have received the invitation email, visit firefly.adobe.com and log in using your Adobe ID. Adobe Firefly transcends the realm of AI image generation it is a comprehensive image editing software encompassing features like the text to image generator and the text effect generator. Additionally, you can access the community gallery to gain insights from prompts created by other users. To generate AI images, navigate to the Adobe Firefly dashboard and select the Generate button. Input your desired prompt or utilize the provided prompts from this tutorial. Links can be found in the video description. Initiate the generation process by clicking Generate. You have the ability to modify parameters such as aspect ratio and content type. It is advisable to include detailed information regarding objects, themes, and specific timing to enhance the quality of your image results. Consider incorporating additional parameters, such as photography techniques, camera specifications, lens types, and specific details pertaining to the desired objects. Adobe Firefly offers four content types, art, graphic, none, and photo. Allow me to illustrate the distinctions between these options. The art type generates images resembling paintings, while the graphic type exhibits digital art styles. On the other hand, the none and photo types produce more natural looking results. The image generator of Adobe Firefly currently comprises 63 styles. Let us observe how these styles impact our image results. To further refine our outcomes, Adobe Firefly provides six color tone options, five lighting styles, and seven composition options. We shall examine the influence of these choices on our image results. Additionally, you can generate variations of an image by selecting the Show Similar button located in the top left corner of the image results. Furthermore, if you have a specific image as a reference for your desired outcome, you can employ it within the tool. Anime Art Now, let us generate anime art utilizing Adobe Firefly's AI capabilities. Text Effects Another noteworthy feature is the text effect generator. Allow me to demonstrate its usage. Click on the text effect tools generate button. Input your desired text in the left input box and your custom text in the right input box. Initiate the generation process by clicking generate. Adobe Firefly will provide four styles for each prompt. Alternatively, you can explore their pre-designed sample effects. Adobe has elevated AI image generation to new heights by creating a user-friendly tool that can be easily comprehended and utilized by individuals. However, as this is a beta version, further enhancements are required. Do you believe this tool will remain free indefinitely? Kindly share your thoughts in the comment section below this video. Adobe has elevated AI image generation to new heights by creating a user-friendly tool that can be easily comprehended and utilized by individuals. However, as this is a beta version, 
further enhancements are required. Do you believe this tool will remain free indefinitely? Kindly share your thoughts in the comment section below this video.